Here he is. First question, Tim McMahon. Russ, how would you explain you guys being so flat through three quarters of this game? Uh, I don't have an explanation for you, but I mean, should have been some sense of urgency on everybody's part. Um, but we fought, um, which is good, and we know what we have to do. It's going to take a lot of effort. It's going to take everyone uh, being uh, uncomfortable um, in their role and making sure that we understand we all have to sacrifice, um, you know, some of the things we may love to do, um, but we got to scramble. Uh, that's the best, that gives us the best chance to, to win games. Alan Spolin. What do you take from the fourth quarter that you can take into into game five? Um, I just said it. Kim Davis. Ken? There we go. Okay. Hey, um, Russ, I know you said you just talk, you just said what you guys can do differently, but were the Lakers doing anything early in the game in terms of um, taking anything away or limiting the spacing you guys had you have early in the game? Um, taking away, I wouldn't. They're doing a good job of getting out to shooters and uh, uh, double teaming, and we just got to be able to make sure the floor is balanced uh, and get what we want. And keep our pace up. Jonathan Pagan. Russ, you mentioned sacrifice some of the things people like to do. What are the sacrifices that you're referring to that you have in mind? Uh, I'm not. I'm not. You know, the coach or make that decision. But individually, um, I know I can't speak for anybody else. But just for myself, um, just making sure that I, I do what I need to do, um, bringing my energy and effort, and competing at a very, very high level for 48 minutes is what um, I need to make sure I need to do. Thank you. Brian Barrett-Hills. Brian Barrett-Hills. All right, we have a question from Seiko Smith. What's, uh, what's the conversation y'all have? You know, at this point, you know, when you get to this point in the season, you know what's at stake, what's happening. Like, what's that conversation that y'all have tomorrow, you know, and in, in the lead-up before the second year? Um, the conversation is, is, number one, is just uh, take care of the play in front of you. And I think that, obviously, it's when to go home. So you have to be able to come out and, and make sure you have that mindset. Uh, and it's one game at a time, uh, especially here down in the bubble. It's a different scenario than any other playoffs. So we're able to, um, you know, take our time and, and make sure we take advantage of our size, man, our speed. We have to do it if we want to win. We just have to uh, because that gives us the best chance of winning. And uh, that conversation, you know, starts tonight, goes on tomorrow, and hopefully uh, we can take care of business on uh, the next game. Thank you, Russell. Yep, yeah, thanks. To